Because having a dick is like having a shitty business partner, but you can't fire him because he's been with the company from the ground up. He's a partner in the firm, you know what I mean? When he was little, he was cute, but he grew up lawsuits, that's it. And every time a guy's talking, it's a negotiation, no matter how you want to slice it, right? And you're having a negotiation, you're like, we got him right where we want him, just don't tell Dick. Ryan is like, are you sure, man? He's a partner in the firm. He's like, you know how he is. He doesn't read the quarterlies. Comes into the meeting, he shoots from the hip. No, fuck him. <laughs> but the, he gets the information. It leaks to him. Where's he at when he gets it? Some whorehouse in Barbados. This is your dick. When he's turned up, he's just white jeans, no shirt. <laughs> Jean vest, he has a bandana. He's a bad guy. When he's turned up, your dick is bad. He has a lava lamp in the background. He has bad taste. He has headphones on, is it bungalow? He doesn't give a fuck. Guy comes in, he's like, hey, Dick, man, they're having a meeting. He's like, what the fuck? Without me? I'm a partner in the goddamn firm. I'm on my way. And he gets on his dirt bike, because why would he not have a dirt bike? You know, he slides past security, opens the door with the front wheel. Fire! Dick, wait! He's like, fuck that contract. You got a deal. Woo! And he's like, Dick, man, you lost his millions. Then what's he do? Once he's done ruining your business, he gets sleepy. <laughs> and he shrivels up to the real him. <laughs> and he's like, why'd you let me do that? <laughs>